a remarkable yeah. young man. His accomplishments, his yeah. education. It was a very revealing conversation, I think. And it was good for us to, to bring you know, Asperger's to light because mm -hmm. for many of us, we actually have been touched by somebody who has a child or mm -hmm. spouse or themselves that has Asperger's. And so mm -hmm. I think it was great to mm -hmm. hear his side of, of, of the story. Well, I think what's valuable about it is rather than an expert talking about people with Asperger's, this is somebody mm -hmm. who is experiencing that and talking about it. And as you guys know, my nephew has Asperger's. And uh, it's been great. You know, he's only been diagnosed for a couple years. He's 11. And his diagnosis was such a breakthrough for us because we didn't know what, what it was, right? And when you understand how he sees the world and what's really going on, then you can actually respond appropriately. Mm -hmm. So I asked him, you know, what would you like me to say about it? you know, for, on, on your behalf. And uh, he said two things. One is, I am not an alien. Mm -hmm. mm. Because sometimes he feels like an alien because he's so different. You know, he said, I'm not an alien. And he said, I just think differently than other people. Yeah. So I like that I'm broken or I'm, yeah. there's something wrong with mm -hmm. me. You know, he says, make sure you tell him it's a syndrome. It's not a disorder, it's a syndrome. And I think that's probably what is so painful about Asperger's is because it really affects your social um, filters mm -hmm. and it's alienating. It's, it's, it, you know, because people don't understand. They think, mm -hmm. oh, that person might just be socially mm -hmm. awkward or what's wrong with them? Like, why don't they respond when mm -hmm. I say this to them? Or why aren't they smiling? Or why do they, you know? And, and so it's so easy to judge yeah. and then it's so easy to just shut down. And, uh, and I think that's what was great about having mm -hmm. him on was he's really trying to be a voice for Asperger's, mm -hmm. but also, you know, like you could see, he was struggling too with, you know, just how to interact on the couch with mm -hmm. each one of you. And that, that's difficult. And here's the challenge for us, is that we need to be more gracious. We mm -hmm. need to take the time to slow down mm -hmm. and care and listen. I mean, he even said, it's like, you can't ask me to do a, a bunch of things. I can't multitask. Whereas for an author, A lot of men cannot multitask. Okay. Well, that, <laughs> I will say that. Let me change what I said, Denise. <laughs> he can't <laughs> multitask on high. No, that was great. But, and every man's going, mm-hmm. But it's that place of where we need to really be patient. We live in this frenetic pace and world of yeah. quick answers and go, 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 go. And if anything's different than the norm, then it's then we kind of say, mm -hmm. I don't want to deal with them. You know what? Let others deal with them. But we actually need to say, okay, I need to be a lot more patient and mm -hmm. listen and not judge so quickly people that are different. It's and it's, it's good that we were able to have Jay on the couch with us. And I just want to give a big shout out to Jennifer in our guesting department mm -hmm. who really made this happen because it's important that we actually put a face behind the diagnosis of Asperger's and mm -hmm. hear from the heart of the person, mm -hmm. as you said, as your nephew has it. And I think it was good experience for us on the couch because, you know, if there's a complaint that we get about us is that we talk, we know we're women, we're all <laughs> talking at once. And, and multitasking. Yeah, 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 we're all talking at once. We gotta just slow down. Hold on, girls. <laughs> And you know what? He 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 couldn't he couldn't have processed that, you know. So we had to learn to like one at a time. Oh, wait, and we to went to listen. To listen. <laughs> now there's a concept. And to go over the questions in advance and let him know. And so it was a different kind of interview for us, but it was us entering his world mm -hmm. and understanding how to make him comfortable and or instead of him always accommodating our world. Mm -hmm. So I yeah. think for us it was yeah. a beautiful experience. And actually. there's also strengths to this, right? Because I think that's the other thing is he's embraced his syndrome because it actually allows him a hyper focus on yeah. certain things right so I mean I can't swim across Lake Ontario right, yeah. I you know and, and all of those things that he is equipped to do um, you know and his uh, he works at the university you know like he's mm -hmm. so he's really it's embraced his smart, diagnosis yeah. and mm -hmm. he's actually used it as a strength what an inspiration though because I think sometimes we discount it's like well you're socially awkward or you have this disability so you're kind of on the margins you know what can mm -hmm. you offer mm -hmm. and with Jay's story it was like uh, he was doing so many things we were kind of like actually embarrassed I'm like he's like I swam across here I'm doing this engineering I'm here on the couch mm -hmm. and he was listing all wrote these things wrote, wrote a guys, book you guys are total slackers <laughs> <laughs> thanks Denise <laughs> Bring it down. I know, but you know what so a lot of people think Bill Gates could be AS I mean that's never been confirmed it's mm -hmm. a rumor but it's, it's the ability to hyper focus on one thing, extreme intelligent, not strong social mm -hmm. skills. And my nephew too, like he's a genius, mm -hmm. you know, he is so smart. And so they have a lot, you know, they have a lot to offer. It's just different. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. Well, and Jay, I know you're watching. So we want to thank you again for spending some time on the Full Circle Couch with us.